Well, our good friend Caitlin Wong is a local registered dietitian, and she's the owner of Beyond the Plate Nutrition. She is on a mission yeah. to help us to get more fruits and veggies into our diet. Hi, Caitlin. How are Hi, you, friend? Hi, Caitlin. Good to see you. Good I'm to see loving you. the colorful display Isn't here. Isn't it beautiful? It, it is beautiful. Gorgeous. Yeah. Nature's bounty. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Yeah. Lovely. Well, every time you come on, you're helping yes. us kind of figure out the best ways to fuel our body. Yeah. So let's talk about what you're doing today. Well, I hope you've also noticed that nothing that I share is ever that groundbreaking. <laughs> But that's a good thing. But it's a good yeah. thing. It's not yeah. overly you're complicated. It simple and it, yeah. Because it's the truth. Yeah. And there's a lot of misinformation out there, but mm. the one thing that hangs true is that we are not getting enough fruits and vegetables. Okay. Yeah. One in ten Americans is actually hitting their daily needs for fruits and vegetables. That's not wow. good. No. But I want to talk about like the why behind it, because yeah. I think that's really important to understand. Yeah. Like, okay, why am I saying yet again you need to fill your plate yeah. with fruits and veggies? So um, the first thing that you may not know is that fruits and vegetables contain prebiotics. Okay. I did not know that. Which feed the um, bacteria in your gut. Right. right. So that's helping boost immunity. It is a great source of fiber. You're getting phytonutrients, antioxidants, all of that from your fruits and vegetables. What's a phytonutrient? <laughs> so a phytonutrient, <laughs> so when you talked about color, yes. so that color that you can see, yeah. that is phyto, the light you can yeah. see from yeah. nutrients, like that is what you are consuming okay. and eating. It's pure Antioxidant, pure this kind of sounds like a little bit depressing. Vitality. Yeah. But we oxidize as we age, like like we rust oh. on the inside, oh. sort of. Oh, gross. Kind so, of like a, a piece of fruit. Yes. Yeah, so gross. an antioxidant, an antioxidant <laughs> is going to help you not not rust. rust. Okay, that's, that's good. To I know. just keep it really simple. That actually simple. helps me understand doesn't better it? what it does. What I know. That means yeah. exactly. Mm -hmm. And there are a lot of ways to get in your fruits and vegetables. Okay. So I it. made a healthy pizza, mm. fruit pizza. Great. The crust is a combination of some flax and chia seeds, some coconut flour. I will be putting these recipes on my Instagram today so Great. you can look them up and follow. Yeah. If you want to top oh, the yes. pizza oh, to top. Okay. and get yeah. creative, there's no right or wrong. What's this so, base? Yeah, so the base is what I was saying, is the coconut yeah. flour, oh, the a, chia flax seed. Oh, and this, sorry, this. Sorry. So you should try, it's amazing. Yeah, what is it? What is so it? it is a combination, <laughs> it's a combination of <laughs> Greek yogurt. So a protein source. Mm. Oh, that's really good. Right? And Ooh, that's and Greek yogurt. I love Greek that. Greek yogurt. Really um, it has some less fat uh, cream cheese. Okay. okay, nice. Some stevia for the sweetness. Yeah. A lot of these like whipped cream dressings or um, yes. toppings yeah. have uh, powdered sugar. So oh, instead of the yes. powdered sugar, I swapped it out for stevia so you're not getting any added sugar. You're That's getting nice. a ton of sugar from your fruit. <laughs> <laughs> you know, this is my half. This is this, yeah, 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 yeah. You, yeah. Just, you can do this half. Yeah. I'll do this yeah, half. Yeah. Well, you've also heard me say combine your fruit or vegetable with protein. Mm -hmm. So yeah. this is a fun way to get that protein in too. And you're getting a yeah. little bit of protein from the flax and chia as well. Um, in about a tablespoon or two of these, you're getting uh, two grams of protein just okay. in oh, wow. this okay. by itself. Put some kiwi on there. I love that it's got that, yeah, that mix of like, you know, the fiber, the protein, and yes. then you've got, and because I also think, and you probably hear this, since people get really focused on protein, yeah. sometimes you get, I don't want to say scared of fruits, but people wonder about yes. the sugar, right? Yes, yeah. yes, and I hear people say that all the time. Um, what I always like to ask people, well, the question I get the most is like, what supplements do you recommend? Yeah. And I go back to, what fruits and vegetables are you eating? There How you many servings are you getting a day? Start there. Yeah. My goal for people is eight to ten servings a day. Okay. Like half cup servings. That's good. Wow. Wasn't it like two to four on like the food pyramid you back know, in like health yes. class? Yes. And yeah. food if you have children that watch Peppa Pig, yeah. yes, they're still singing the song. Fruits and vegetables keep us alive. Always remember to eat your five. That's wrong. Oh. Eight to ten. Eight to ten. So eight when they ten. sing so that, Peppa Pig is I yell at you. Need a saying. new rhyme. Yell at my children. Wrong. Yeah, wrong. Eight to ten. Eight to ten. But speaking Come of kids, on, Peppa. yeah, let's go. Fruit skewers, fruit, fruit kebabs. I've mm -hmm. chopped that up all nicely for you. Oh, I had some watermelon this, this morning with breakfast. Banana. Ooh. Make a fruit skewer, a kebab. Yep. If you're struggling to get your kids to eat fruits and vegetables, yep. get them involved. Have them yeah. make something like this. The colors are make fun. it a craft. Yes. Try popsicles. That's why I have this out. Um, it's summertime. If you want something fun to do yes. and healthy. This is a great way to yep. do yeah. that. I love how the pizza turned out, by the way. This is really fun. It looks good. And it's it's really easy to make. I mean, yeah. the crust itself, 10 minutes prep, 10 minutes in the oven at 350, and you're done. That's it. That's yeah. awesome. Yeah. The last thing I want to talk about is what another thing that you're getting from your fruits and vegetables is water. How did you make that so fast? Okay, water. Yes, sorry. Attention. Just <laughs> 
crabs? Most of our fruits actually are 75 to 95 percent water. Okay. Mm. So my favorite post-workout is to have cantaloupe or watermelon or pineapple immediately after yep. to get that um, glucose restored, yes. that mm -hmm. blood sugar, like and then water. Hydration. Ooh, that's easy. Good. Well, I made you this. Oh, thanks, buddy. Thank you. Beautiful. That's that oh, so nice. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers to you. Don't, Thank you. Don't stab yourself. Yeah, no, I, won't, I won't stab Those myself. Those are aggressive oh, skewers. Oh, oh. <laughs> mm, I love cantaloupe. So good. It makes yeah, it more so fun. Good. Yeah, good And this time of year, I know our friend Katie is coming on later to talk mm -hmm. about um, what farmer's markets you can go to. Yes. That's another great way to get your family involved. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Go to the farmer's market, see what's mm -hmm. in season, stock up on those things, and you probably will find a fruit or a vegetable you didn't know you liked. Okay until you try it at the farmer's market when it's yeah. in season and it's like the absolute best when you've ever had. Fresh. Yes. Yes. Is yeah. there like is there too many fruits or vegetables that you can eat in well, your That's opinion? a good question. I've Thanks, been Jill. A, I, I, well, I was thinking the same thing. I was like, how much is too much? Yeah. Yes. So I've been a dietitian for 11 years mm -hmm. and I have yet to meet someone in, in person yeah. but has ever had too many. Now, okay. when you're adding in more fruits yeah. and vegetables, you're going to increase the amount of fiber that you're consuming. Yeah. You mm -hmm. may experience bloating or some digestion changes because you're now bloating yourself with extra. Yeah. Right. Increase your water, increase your movement, and then back off a little bit until you can tolerate more yeah. and like yeah. slowly ease your way into it. But unless you have like an allergy to something or intolerance or sensitivity, yeah. I really yeah. haven't seen someone okay. like overdo it. Does That's it matter if you mm -hmm. do a smoothie versus eating just raw? So smoothie, I'm okay with okay. Yeah. because the fiber is still relatively intact. You're breaking it down a little bit with mm -hmm. the mechanical, um, I was supposed to say exfoliation, but you yes. know, the breakdown. Yes. Mm -hmm. But um, juices, I don't love as much because you're then pulling out the fiber. Okay. So ah. smoothie's fine. Smoothie's fine. In their whole form, I think it's the best yeah. and most yeah. convenient. Definitely. So, I yeah. just realized how hungry I was. I ate that entire skewer. This was nice to have. And you have a whole well, bowl of Greek yogurt there. Oh my goodness, I love yeah. that. So you mentioned the recipe so that people yes. can find on your Instagram. Yes, Let's give everybody all the things. details. Yes. Yeah. So my Instagram is Caitlin Wong at Caitlin Wong RD on Instagram. I will be posting these recipes today. Give me a follow. Send me a message if you have questions about things. Yep. Um, I love the education piece. So mm -hmm. that's what I'm here for. We're Just always good people too. You know. Good people. We love having you Thank on the you. show. We really do. You're fun. so down to earth. Yeah. You make it easy to understand, and uh, you feed us too, which is always great. <laughs> so we can't complain about that. Thank yeah. you, Kate. Thank you. Yeah. Great Give her a follow. tips and ideas as always. Yeah. yeah. We've got all the information for you right there on the screen. Coming up next, our buddy Blake from Daniel's Vineyard is here with a big discount for you on tickets to their summer concert series. That's right. You will not want to miss the atmosphere out there, the wine, mm. live music. Maybe a little charcuterie board. Ooh, charcuterie, you make me say. <laughs> Look at all that kiwi. Oh. That is, that's one kiwi right there. That's a good one. Uh -huh. mm.